I'm going to try something a bit more impressive. I need somebody else to help me out. Someone to raise their hand. Uh, what's your name, sir? Costa. Costa? Costa, come on up. We're going to try something really unique. That was a buster. One time I actually went out. Now, when I was first starting out with mind reading stuff, I was trying mind reading with a deck of cards. And traveling down from Pickering to Toronto, one day I actually forgot the deck of cards I was going to be mind reading with. So I had to stop in one of those local subway station stop things. And I had to pick up something kind of random. I picked up a magazine that one day. And I had to come up with something on the spot that I would do from then on. What I wanted to do is I wanted to slip through this magazine. I wanted to look through every single page, make sure they're all different. I wanted to try and angle it so the cloud can see they're all different too. And once you're happy, I want to just turn to any random page you want. Make sure it's a page with a lot of writing. Can I stand over here? Turn to a paragraph page, a page with a lot of paragraphs, not a picture page. A good one. What I want to do is I want you to scan through those pages. I want you to look through those paragraphs. And I want you to just think of one word. Make it an interesting word, perhaps a longer one, just so just to help build the suspense a little bit. Tell me when you've gotten one. Okay. Make it an interesting one. You got one? Yeah. Is that word a longer word or a smaller word? It's a long word. It's a long word? I want you to also think, just to make this interesting, I want you to think of the word before it as well. You got that word as well? Yeah. Is that word a longer word or a shorter word? Short. Short word? All right. I want you to think of the shorter word first. Just think of it. I want you to think about how many letters there are in that word. It's a very short word, isn't it? I'm seeing like two or three letters. Yeah. Why don't you just think of it? It's a two-letter word, isn't it? Yeah. Yes? This one's just a warm-up. I'm getting a feeling one of those letters is an O. Yes? Watch, keep those words in <laughs> Letters to know. I just want to make sure everybody tells right. What was what was this? What was the other letter that wasn't to know? It's all right if you tell me this one. G. G. So the word was go. Yeah. Interesting. All right. Cool. Cool. I want you to just think of the longer word now. I want you to think of the first letter of the longer word. Okay. Just think of that first letter. Do you know how to spell it if you close the magazine or? Yeah, yeah, good, good. You can close the magazine and then just think of that word. I don't want you to think I'm like looking at your eyes and wandering the page or something. I want you to just keep going through. I don't want you to think of that first letter. All right, I think I've got the first letter. I want you to think of the second letter now. Think of the third letter. That one's not right. I went too quickly there. I want you to think of the rest of the word now. Just keep spelling out in your head the whole word. It's almost like two words in one, isn't it? Yes? All right, cool, cool. You have no idea how much concentration this takes right now to try and read you. Okay, I think I got it. I think I can figure it out from here. That's a really long word. I couldn't even put this on the chalkboard. Watch, I'm just going to hold this up high so I can't do anything. What was the word you were just thinking of? Heartbreakingly. Heartbreakingly? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 